Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel English is my passion. I'm Yeti. So as I said in one of my videos, I've never visited or lived in an English speaking country, but I believe that I'm pretty good at English listening because I can understand both native and non-native speakers without any efforts. No matter how thick their accent is, no matter where they're from, how fast they speak, I can communicate with them very well. And I'm making this video for people who are struggling with English listening. And in this video, you'll be able to test your listening skills, plus learn how to practice it effectively. And all of the methods are based on my personal experience so you can trust me and let's get started I don't like regular pot coffee from from a diner or a restaurant or something like that I like to get good quality coffee from good coffee roasters I don't like regular pot coffee from from a diner or a restaurant or something like that. I like to get good quality coffee from good coffee roasters. She could not find the man she loved. Her happiness turned to misery and she had no more tears to cry. So finally, with nowhere else to go, she decided to return to the land of the living. She could not find the man she loved. Her happiness turned to misery and she had no more tears to cry. So finally, with nowhere else to go, she decided to return to the land of the living. They require app makers to use their payment systems. Google and Apple have faced a lot of criticism for their requirements on payment systems. They require app makers to use their payment systems. Google and Apple have faced a lot of criticism for their requirements on payment systems. So you can use the language that you learned in this video, do it down in the comments, or you can jump over to the mm English blog where you might even want to pose some questions to the others who are there chatting about the book in the comments below my blog post. So you can use the language that you learned in this video, do it down in the comments, or you can jump over to the mm English blog where you might even want to pose some questions to the others who are there chatting about the book in the comments below my blog post. You know what we should all do? Go see a musical. <laughs> sure. And you know which one we should see? The 1996 Tony Award winner. You know what we should all do? Go see a musical. <laughs> Sure. And you know which one we should see? The 1996 Tony Award winner. I love flashcards. Mm. It's very basic, but I love flashcards, so I always like to make them on my phone as well. There's some apps that you can use, and I always use like the spaced repetition system. I love flashcards. Mm. It's very basic, but I love flashcards, so I always like to make them on my phone as well. There's some apps that you can use, and I always use like the spaced repetition system. You know, if I was trying to sell you a pen and you didn't buy it, okay, I could blame the pen, it's not good. But when the product is me, when it's me appearing on the national TV and serving millions of audience all across the nation, it is getting harder and harder to sleep at night. You know, if I was trying to sell you a pen and you didn't buy it, okay, I could blame the pen, it's not good. But when the product is me, when it's me appearing on the national TV and serving millions of audience all across the nation, it is getting harder and harder to sleep at night. 
He likes Sarah. She does poosh with me and she is the one who like I'll tell most things to. Most things. <laughs> and how long have you guys been friends? Since high school. Like Sarah. She does poosh with me and she is the one who like I'll tell most things to. Most things. <laughs> and how long have you guys been friends? Since high school. I'm not the same kind of tween girl you guys are. But we love all the same things. I've changed. I don't like Beyonce. <gasps> Take that back. Or Britney. <gasps> or Gaga. <gasps> I only fake it because you guys like that stuff. I'm not the same kind of tween girl you guys are. But we love all the same things. I've changed. I don't like Beyonce. <gasps> Take that back. Or Britney. <gasps> or Gaga. <gasps> I only fake it because you guys like that stuff. I never ever thought that I'd be like a dish person because I don't get it at all. Like the psychology of it, I don't understand why anyone would collect loads of dishes. I never ever thought that I'd be like a dish person because I don't get it at all. Like the psychology of it, I don't understand why anyone would collect loads of dishes. If we're not the most powerful, if two more of us band together, it makes us powerful. It's like co-signing the woman in the meeting, you know, the woman who, who can't seem to get her word out, or just making sure that other person who can't make a point is being heard. Our job is to make sure they have room for that. If we're not the most powerful, if two more of us band together, it makes us powerful. It's like co-signing the woman in the meeting, you know, the woman who, who can't seem to get her word out, or just making sure that other person who can't make a point is being heard. Our job is to make sure they have room for that. And it depends on the workplace. Certainly in smaller workplaces, there isn't like a big HR, human resources department to go yeah. to to get help. But I think if you witness it in a coworker, the first thing is to let them know, hi, I see something's changing. We need to work as a team here. Is there something that I can talk with you about? Mm -hmm. And it depends on the workplace. Certainly in smaller workplaces, there isn't like a big HR, human resources department to go yeah. to to get help. But I think if you witness it in a coworker, the first thing is to let them know, hi, I see something's changing. We need to work as a team here. Is there something that I can talk with you about? Mm -hmm. Kendall deserves it. She did the best. We're not haters. We're not haters. And I would have won had my knee been fine. So we already know that. Kendall deserves it. She did the best. We're not haters. We're not haters. And I would have won had my knee been fine. So we already know that. Look at money. Money's kind of a psychotic subject. Everybody's got all these crazy ideas and beliefs and, and money's the root of all evil and only rich and rich people are corrupt and, you know, all these crazy ideas. It's just money. Money. Money's kind of a psychotic subject. Everybody's got all these crazy ideas and beliefs and, and money's the root of all evil and only rich and rich people are corrupt and, you know, all these crazy ideas. It's just money. I love looking at my writing this way because it allows me to silence the inner critic and just enjoy my writing exactly where it is, exactly where I am in this moment. Will you become a better writer in the future? Yes, because we all become better at what we do. I love looking at my writing this way because it allows me to silence the inner critic and just enjoy my writing exactly where it is, exactly where I am in this moment. Will you become a better writer in the future? Yes, because we all become better at what we do. Lately, I've really been looking up Billie Eilish. I think she's incredible, and I think there's not a single, like, project of hers or song of hers or like even like the ads that she does they're all so spectacular and so uniquely her and I think she's you know one of the best artists of all time. Lately I've really been looking up Billie Eilish. I think she's incredible and I think there's not a single like project of hers or song of hers or like even like the ads that she does they're all so spectacular and so uniquely her and I think she's you know one of the 
best artists of all time. Um. This has been the first tour that I've been on that I have really felt grounded and that home is wherever I am. And I think a lot of people say like, home is where your heart is, home is where your loved ones are. And well, I'm apart from my loved ones on tour. And I'm, if home is dependent upon other people, that I'm never gonna be home. No. This has been the first tour that I've been on that I have really felt grounded and that home is wherever I am. And I think a lot of people say like, home is where your heart is, home is where your loved ones are. And well, I'm apart from my loved ones on tour. And I'm, if home is dependent upon other people, that I'm never gonna be home. Never. So, when you are pounding the pavement, you already have a certain layer of confidence because you've already surpassed the doubt of the two most important people to you. So when you are pounding the pavement, you already have a certain layer of confidence because you've already surpassed the doubt of the two most important people to you. So I can't have kids. Big deal. This way, there's no one to hold me back in life. No one to keep me from traveling where I want to travel. No one getting in the way of my career. If you want to know the truth of it, I'm glad you guys aren't real. So I can't have kids. Big deal. This way there's no one to hold me back in life. No one to keep me from traveling where I want to travel. No one getting in the way of my career. If you want to know the truth of it, I'm glad you guys aren't real. And, and so we really had to quite literally trust each other because he had to hold my weight and I had to hold him, you know? So it was just kind of like a great icebreaker. You yeah, know what it I'm was, saying? yeah. Great icebreaker. And, and so we really had to quite literally trust each other because he had to hold my weight and I had to hold him, you know? So it was just kind of like a great icebreaker. You yeah, know what it I'm was, saying? Yeah. Great icebreaker. That's I guess in this case, every time you talk about... Okay, what do we got here? I mean... Am I attracted to her? Yes. Would I ever act on it? No. No way. Not while my wife is still alive. I guess in this case, every time you talk about... Okay, what do we got here? I mean, am I attracted to her? Yes. Would I ever act on it? No. No way. Not while my wife is still alive. Have the posters on the wall, which I think were the most important element in the room. I think they're really what brings the room together and adds that brightness and old school look that I wanted. I got myself a desk over here. I really like just how simple and plain it looks. I think that there's kind of already a lot going on in the room. It's posters on the wall, which I think were the most important element in the room. I think they're really what brings the room together and adds that brightness and old school look that I wanted. I got myself a desk over here. I really like just how simple and plain it looks. I think that there's kind of already a lot going on in the room. It's right. It was so like surreal getting to work with her, but we got this one scene together where we're both sort of like at each other. And they're really, the two of them really sort of butt heads, their characters. So we were just able to have like loads of fun with it. And it was so like surreal getting to work with her, but we got this one scene together where we're both sort of like at each other. And they're really, the two of them really sort of butt heads, their characters. So we were just able to have like loads of fun with it. And I'm going on a run for the first time in well it's like my first time actually committing to a workout since april of last year it's been about a year since i'm actually doing physical activity on my own will um and in terms of going on a run i don't think i've done that since my mile test i'm going on a run for the first time in well it's like my first time actually committing to a workout since april of last year it's been about a year since I'm actually doing physical activity on my own will. Um, and in terms of going on a run, I don't think I've done that since my mile test. I'm like my first boyfriend who cheated on me, so it was like, well, yeah, you know, you slept with another girl. That's the reason we're not together. This time it was like, I don't know what I did wrong. I don't know. He didn't do anything wrong. Just stopped loving each other, which is more, more devastating than having a specific reason and I felt like a complete failure. And like my first boyfriend who cheated on me, so it was like, well yeah, you know, you slept with another girl, that's the reason we're not together. This time it was like, I don't know what I did wrong, I don't know, he didn't do anything wrong. Just stop loving each other, which is more, more devastating than having a specific reason and I felt like a complete failure.
Someone's left a glass on the coffee table. There's no coaster. It's a cold drink. It's a hot day. <laughs> Little beads of condensation are inching their way closer and closer to the surface of the wood. Stop it! <laughs> Someone's left a glass on the coffee table. There's no coaster. It's a cold drink. It's a hot day. <laughs> Little beads of condensation are inching their way closer and closer to the surface of the wood. Stop it! <laughs> yeah, but that was me like doing my expression and doing what I loved, I guess. But I definitely have toned it down a lot since then. That's been a part of growing up and, you know, I'm still gaining confidence in, in how I look and probably still will be for, you know, a very long time. Yeah, but that was me like doing my expression and doing what I loved, I guess. But I definitely have toned it down a lot since then. That's been a part of growing up and, you know, I'm still gaining confidence in, in how I look and probably still will be for, you know, a very long time. <laughs> when the hell are people gonna learn? Oh, it may not be as bad as it seems. Her hand is holding that device steady. Or maybe her hand is simply in there with the ammo. We can't know. Yo, know, my guys talk to the friend. That device is homemade, which means it's unstable and very unreliable. <laughs> when the hell are people gonna learn? Oh, it may not be as bad as it seems. Her hand is holding that device steady. Or maybe her hand is simply in there with the ammo. We can't know. Yo, know, my guys talk to the friend. That device is homemade, which means it's unstable and very unreliable. No. I mean, I made her, right? Yeah. I'm her Dr. Frankenstein. She's my monster. And, and if I'm being honest, she's actually exceeding my expectations. And um, listen, would I like a little credit? Sure. I mean, I made her, right? Yeah. I'm her Dr. Frankenstein. She's my monster. And, and if I'm being honest, She's actually exceeding my expectations. And um, listen, would I like a little credit? Sure. Clear. And probably the clearest evidence of all comes from ancient records where we can actually see what the planet was like before humans were involved. This is why climate scientists, 99% on almost every study of climate scientists, shows that we're you know, as unanimous as the scientific community ever gets and that this evidence is real and that it's happening. Clear. And probably the clearest evidence of all comes from ancient records where we can actually see what the planet was like before humans were involved. This is why climate scientists, 99% on almost every study of climate scientists, shows that we're you know, as unanimous as the scientific community ever gets, and that this evidence is real and that it's happening. I've been wanting to talk about it since a few months ago. What should I listen to? Do you have any channels or podcasts that you recommend? What are your favorite listening materials? These are the most common questions that I get every single day. And to tell the truth, I don't really have a specific answer to these questions because our likes and dislikes are different from each other. So I suggest asking yourself instead of asking other people for their suggestions or recommendations, you should ask yourself two questions. Basically, there are two forms of listening materials, audios such as podcasts or audios on websites and videos such as movies or videos on social media like YouTube. What do you prefer, audios or videos? The second question, what do I enjoy listening to? What do I enjoy watching? So I personally love watching interviews of celebrities like actors or singers or actresses, etc. Like basically whatever is related to entertainment. So what about you? What are you interested in? IT, fashion, cooking, travel, sports, education, business, art, etc. etc. So you should know the topics that can interest you. And you need to accept the fact that other people's recommendations are based on their personal preferences. They're not you. You don't have to force yourself to listen to a podcast or to watch a movie just because people are telling you to do so. You'd better focus on your happiness and enjoyment because English as a language is not a subject. You have to learn it little by little throughout your life. So in the long run, your happiness is important. Your happiness matters. 
Focus on your happiness. So many people have trouble understanding native speakers or understanding everything that they listen to, especially in the beginning. Because if you've started learning English recently, your ears might not be used to listening to a new language. So you might be able to catch each word, but you don't get the idea or the main point of the speaker. And sometimes they speak too fast that you miss most of what they said. And I know it'd be very frustrating when you can't understand a person just because they speak English. So you need to hang in there and keep practicing or listening to them whether you understand them or not. Carry on watching videos or listening to podcasts with the help of subtitles. And within a few months, you'll be able to catch most of what they say without any subtitles. But to reach that level, you do need patience and determination. Because if you give up just because it's difficult, it'll always be difficult for you. So I suggest keeping practicing, even if it's difficult, even if it's tough, even if it's hard in the beginning. Again, stop treating English as a subject is a language, is a tool for you to communicate with people from all over the world. You all might have different reasons for learning English, but at the end of the day, your purpose is to apply it in various forms of communication, right? So why don't you join conversation clubs or speaking clubs, reading clubs, listening clubs, movie clubs or stuff like that. Joining conversation clubs based in other countries is a good idea because you can expose yourself to a variety of accents and gradually you'll be able to understand people no matter where they're from. That is all for now and I know it's very disappointing when you don't get a person because you're still struggling with your English listening. I can really sympathize with you because I've already been there myself, you know, so please keep in mind that you're not alone in this language journey. And I'll see you in the next video and before you leave, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Bye!